Oh yes, a simple three-step, two-minute skincare routine twice a day to have excellent looking skin. Let's get into it. How's it going everybody? George here from GP Last, helping you guys dress better, look better, and ultimately be better through style, tutorial, and tips, videos like this. And in today's video, guys, I'll be going over a simple two-minute, three-step skincare routine that any guy can do to have great looking skin, as well as giving you guys the correct products to use to meet your skincare goals. Without further delay, let's jump into it. The basic premise of this skincare routine is a cleanse, treat, and moisturize twice a day. When it comes to cleansing your skin, you gotta pick out the correct cleanser for your skin type. I'm gonna do a quick short version of this, but there's basically three categories of skin when it comes to picking out a cleanser. Dry skin, normal skin, and oily skin. Now, if you already know what kind of skin you have, you can just pick out the correct cleanser. But if you don't know what your skin is, what I want you to do is wash your face with whatever you're using right now. Don't put anything else on your face and leave it for about an hour and then go back and see how your skin reacts to it. If it's dry, you got dry. If it's normal, no oiliness or dryness, you have normal skin. And if it's oily, you guessed it, you have oily skin. Now, picking out the correct cleanser is super easy to do. Once you have your skin type, it usually just says on the bottle what it is. I use a hydrating cleanser. This is great for dry to normal skin. And if you have oily skin, you can definitely use a non-oily cleanser or a cleanser designed for oily skin. And I also prefer to use a non-foaming cleanser just because I like it. In order to properly use your cleanser, what you're gonna do is you're gonna wash your face with lukewarm water. Apply a couple of pumps, two to three pumps of your cleanser or a nice fat glove, and begin to massage it into your skin using counterclockwise circles for about 30 seconds. Once that's done, you're going to rinse off your face with lukewarm water. Which brings us to step number two, which is gonna be the treat portion. What are we treating when it comes to your skin? Is it something like acne or is it something like preventing or further diminishing the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles? Starting it off with acne, my favorite thing to use is a benzyl peroxide for spot treatment. So if you notice you have breakouts forming or you have a couple of pimples, you can actually put a little bit on it to spot treat the area. You can also use this if you have any redness, irritation, or you can actually use it as a post shave if you have razor bumps or irritation. That's what I do and that's one of my little skincare hacks. Now the biggest thing you're gonna do for treating your acne is gonna be using salicylic acid. Not only is this a great base layer to help absorb anything else you're gonna be putting on your skin, it helps get into those pores, really helps clean them out and prevents that excess buildup of sebum. Now if your acne is okay or you're just gonna do a spot treatment, then you can go on to use something like either hyaluronic acid or retinol. Now hyaluronic acid is a skin filler it is used to diminish the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles and really give your skin that hydrated youthful look one of the pro tips here is that you can also use this on your lips and underneath your eyes for your lips is going to make them look fuller and more moisturized and for underneath your eyes if you do looking tired that's the thinnest skin on the body so you can actually make it look a little fuller and less tired. Now, retinol is a long-term collagen builder, but you only want to use this in your nighttime skincare routine because this does burn away those first few layers of skin in order to stimulate collagen production. It's not something you want to go out into the sun with, but having a hyaluronic in the morning for a skin filler and retinol at night for a long-term collagen builder is great for keeping your skin looking as young for as long as possible. On to the last step of the routine, and yes, it's to moisturize, but we're keeping this short and as with few products as possible, and that is to use an SPF moisturizer in the morning. All you wanna do is you wanna get a pea-sized glob on your fingers, you wanna spread it out a little bit and thoroughly massage it into your skin, applying it evenly. Now, I know some guys are gonna think, oh, just because I have darker skin tone or live in an environment where it's completely sunny or I'm not super pale like you, George, I don't need SPF. It doesn't matter what your skin tone is, the sun will fuck you up. So using something like this, uh, CeraVe with hyaluronic ceramides and niacinamides, and SPF 30, it's great. You get that bang for your buck there. You get your SPF and you get your moisturizer and it's really a no brainer. Now for your nighttime skincare routine moisturizer, you're not gonna be using obviously an SPF moisturizer because you're going to bed. You're not going out in the sun. Definitely I recommend using a regular moisturizer or something like the CeraVe 
PM moisturizer because it has hyaluronic acid, niacinamides, and serenamides. I, I really suck at this pronunciation, but basically what these help to do is to keep your skin as moisturized as possible, keep your skin looking fuller, and help with that replenishment of new skin cells. There you guys have it. That is a simple two-minute, three-step skincare routine that any guy can do to have great-looking skin, whether you're dealing with acne or just want your skin to look young as healthy as possible. If you guys made it this far into the video, be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel because if you watch this far, I can tell you're way more serious about dressing better, looking better and ultimately being better and i'd like to help you out along the way thank you guys so much for watching be sure to check out some of my other videos on screen right now peace